Here we will model hammer head with the help of lifted boss base and flex feature in SolidWorks. So let's start to create. First, we will create few planes. Let's say right click and show main front plane. Activate plane, and we need two plane at twenty five millimeter. Look, here I am going to select. Two planes, so that twenty-five, twenty-five, you will see two planes. Say, and see, we created two planes at a time. See, the plane two is fifty millimeter away from plane, refer, uh, front plane, and twenty-five millimeter away from plane one. Now we will create one more plane. So, I'll choose plane two, reference plane, and this is going to be forty millimeter. Say okay. now we have three planes so let's start to create our sketch i'll choose front plane sketch now from here i'll activate center rectangle and we will create a rectangle a square actually not rectangle hold shift key and select both the vertical and horizontal line and make constraint equal activate the smart dimension 60 mm see now simply exit look just go to plane 2 sketch activate circle and start from origin point and draw a circle now assign dimension 50 mm exit that's it now activate plane 2 sketch activate here one more circle and this circle let's make up to end of this square now see we allocate this point that's why this is fully defined sketch exit now we will copy this to this so simply select sketch 3 edit copy and activate or click on plane 3 go to edit paste look we did not create the same we just paste this one to plane 1 to uh, plane 2 to 3 now we will activate lifted boss base feature now first here we have to choose a close profile or any even though you can choose open but we have a close so i'll choose this point because this is going to be a reference point second third or the fourth if i am going to choose see this is lies these these green points are called connectors and this is perfectly aligned we don't need to choose anything more here just say yes create one more plane and this time i am going to choose this face and 200 mm say okay now activate plane 4 sketch and here i am going to draw one center rectangle activate smart dimension the overall length is 150 the height 5 mm and make sure it is started from origin point exit now again we will apply lifted boss base feature now here i'll choose this first and i'll choose this upper one now see it is selected upper edge even if you change bottom see you can change the, this green dots called connector here also we don't need to change anything say okay now now it's time to use flex tool to make a bend or twist to this in command just uh, click flex search and here you will find flex even though you can directly activate or here you will see a i option if you click i action it will it is a show command location now i click now it is open see it is automatically open and it will show you look this green see it shows here its location flex now in flex i'll show you few things there are 
flex in input plane 1 plane 2 triad flex let's activate plane input i'll choose this bending we want to bend this one part degree and everything we will put letter then here plane 1 plane 2 you will see here this red color is plane 2 green color is plane 1 so we will go for plane 2 because we want to move plane 2 to particular location now here we have to assign reference entity so i am going to choose this point or this vertex so that plane moves from here to this vertex now we want to bend this one so here we have to assign few directions otherwise it will rotate in any direction so right click align to we want to fix x y z axis so in this scenario right plane is perfect it is along with y axis okay now we want to move plane 1 towards plane 2 now plane 2 is going to fix so right click and here select move try to plane 2 now the objects going to move along with plane 2 so i am going to if you see look this is going to move along plane 2 which is allocated here from here you can change angle look even though radius you can change anything you can just do it forty look twenty five is going to be perfect say yes by default it's already selected bending let me activate here color so this is the simple tutorial where we created a hammer head with the help of looted boss base and flex tool i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching